Hi, it's Chica from Chica and Joe, and today we are going to turn this ugly dead fern into some really cool Halloween decorations using spray paint. So why do I even have a dead fern in the first place? Is my green thumb really that bad? Well, not exactly. What happens is I hang these from my front porch every year four of them usually, and within a week, every single time, a bird comes along, makes a nest, lays its eggs, and I've got babies growing in the fern. Well, I'm not going to water this fern when there's a nest in there full of eggs and babies. I don't want to flood the babies, so I let the fern go. I don't water it, and this is what I end up with at the end of the summer. But I figured out that even though it's ugly when it's green and brown, if I hit it with a little black spray paint, it turns into some pretty cool, creepy, and low-budget Halloween decorations, so let's hit it. <laughs> are painted black we want to make the pot look good too so let's tip this down and I like to paint it with a nice bright color something fun purple that'll match nicely for Halloween you obviously cannot do this before you spray paint or else you will end up painting all over your purple doesn't have to just be ferns either this was a beautiful flowering plant that I had on my porch all summer it's dead too not from not watering just because it's the end of the summer so let's see if we can paint this too I'm here on my front porch with my painted plant. Let's go set it up and see what we can do for some Halloween decorations. I'm going to put these glittery orange spiders in here. They look really cute. And then I'm going to stretch some spider webs, some faux spider webs over everything. That'll make it look really nice and kind of spooky. And I'm going to decorate the walls here. I've got these paper bats I'm going to put up. I've got these orange pumpkins. I'm going to create a whole scene here for the front porch. It's going to look super cute. And that fern just looks perfect and nestled in there. Just the thing I needed to fill the space. And here's the finished front porch with the painted fern, with some spiders, some spider webs, bats, all of this together to make a really cool front porch decoration here in my house. Thanks for watching, we really appreciate it. And remember, think outside the box with your Halloween decor. There's quite a bit you can do with a can of spray paint. Please do us a favor and hit like and subscribe so that you don't miss any more of our cool Halloween or other holiday decorations and really fun DIY projects. Thanks.